I'm Kenny Brack. The team I'm driving for here is called Allspurgs Ford. This is the X Games in Los Angeles and it's the biggest uh, extreme sports uh, event I think in the world. It's huge here. It's uh, thousands of people and uh, all kinds of different uh, sports. I've enjoyed a lot of success in IndyCar racing of course, the uh, Indy 500 winner and the IndyCar champion and stuff like that. But this is rally cars and it's extremely different to what I'm used to. Um, a lot slower obviously, but uh, still uh, very very difficult to drive them fast. The course is very very tight, so it's very unforgiving. You, 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 it's very easy to hit something. It, it reminds me of an oval actually. But, um, but the, the sport is very accessible because in the cars you, you cannot drive them unless you work out for two, three hours a day, six days a week physically impossible. Uh, these cars you can get in and uh, the g-forces are low and if you have uh, driving experience you can actually uh, there's no physical limitations you, you can actually get in them and, and, and drive to the best of your ability uh, and, and not feel uh, restrained. The car that we're driving here, uh, Andreas Eriksson built them and he obviously um, his game is uh, rallycross uh, and there's different rules uh, here and there and, and uh, rallycross, a rallycross track is usually a little more open, um, you have a different tire, this tire is a, a normal street course tire, gravel tire and we have a lot of horsepower, a lot of torque and, and you just can't get it down to the ground. Uh, so you have to adjust for this uh, and it's quite difficult uh, for the team and, and also for the drivers to, to get to, to a good balance and to get a good speed out of it. Particular thing about this place is to have this, uh, uh, the jump. Um, and you might have seen the, the motocross guys do, you know, back flips and stuff. They build a jump like that for cars. I hope nobody's going to do a backflip. And I hope if somebody does it, I hope it's not me. But it's going to be quite uh, challenging because this jump we don't get to practice. Because down in the stadium on the gravel part now, they, they're having the motorbikes doing tricks and stuff. So Saturday night, just before the event, is when they're going to build the, the, the rally course. So we might get one try at this jump on s uh, Sunday morning before the, you know, the elimination starts. Personally, for me, not having much of this uh, you know, rally or rallycross experience, I feel it's quite a challenge, but you know, I, I'd rather go long than short, because uh, if you go short, you end up in the other track, so yeah.